What is going on guys? Welcome back. This is part two of my DC Universe Online Superman tutorial walkthrough. And in case you're wondering, yes, I changed Ember Flame's appearance from the last video. I just was not digging that look and decided I didn't like it. So between the last video and this one, I did a little upgrading, so to speak. I gave her the scorching chroma material, the scorching aura for her head, hands, and feet, and put the scorching chroma on her outfit, changed her outfit from earlier, and yeah. She still has the orange smoke when she runs, so I left that because it fits with the fire. But anyway, and while I was at it, I went ahead and put my bank out and my other stuff, my mailbox. There's my R&D center, my dispenser, which I'll be able to use later, the broker, which I'll be able to use later. And then there's my respec station if I want to reset my skill points, redo my loadout. There's my teleporter. Now the respec station, the mailbox, the bank, R&D, broker, all that. Like I said before in the last video, if you go to the marketplace, go up to redeem claim, go into my list where I've got all my different stuff I can use. Depending on what kind of character I have, what I want to do, yada yada. You know, I got different materials, different chromas, different types of weapons, auras. You know, I've got Batman's, you know, Batman's headpiece. You know, I've got a snowflake aura for an ice character. I've got Harley, some of Harley's stuff. I got a bunch of stuff I can use. Gold material, silver, just stuff I've acquired over the years that I can use. Which you guys will not have at the very beginning. Like I said, I've gotten this stuff over the years. You'll you'll acquire it from the marketplace when you can, and there you go. <clears throat> so don't expect to have what I have right away. Don't do it. But anyway, let's roll and get going with our next mission, shall we? And like I said in the other the other video, we're going to be right here at our next mission anyway once we go outside. So, as they say, let's roll. We'll have to come back here in a minute. But right now I'm going over here to this other area. Oh, you want to play? Yeah, I bet it did. Superman speaking. Given your past work, I know you're the one to handle this situation. The Hive and Queen Bee are usually more interested in creating drones than hijacking trucks. But that's just what they're doing at the Metropolis Metrodome. They're attacking Star Labs transports to steal mass payloads of exobytes. We must reduce our losses. Those exobytes are critical to defeating Brainiac. Feel the sting of Sazzler's wrath! Feel the sting 
Here's the first one that we can get. Primary training mandate. Swarm them. Now, we gotta go over here. Yep, right here. These trucks. Somebody's already done it. Help us. We've got to get these exobytes out of here before Hive overruns us. All right, these guys are all right. Let's go to the next one. We've got to get these exobytes out of here before Hive gets their hands on them. Oh no! All right, these guys are all right. There's level 10. Information. I don't understand why they would want exobytes. They're just mindless drones under the influence of Queen Zazzle's I'm going to go ahead and put that in my super speed. Which, by the way, you should not breathe. Got it? Iconic powers. And I'm going to go ahead and give myself heat vision. Just to have it. The hive has turned the Metrodome into a fortress to defend their stolen exobytes and spread Don't their mind-controlling hypnopollen across the city. <clears throat> take out those dispensers and tag the exobyte containers for pickup. The Star Labs will take it from there. I don't know why it keeps giving me that. I don't need the on-duty menu right now. Alright. I'm hit! All right, let's get the heck out of here. We're going to go right over here. Active and the exercise intact. Returning to base. The locator beacon was accurate. We've got a plan to weaken Hive's assault. Mr. Luther is it's providing a real an mess override out there code. If you can, can put a dent on their supplies, station, we might just get a foothold on the compound. Looks good, Command. Containment on the exobytes is not complete. Returning to base. And like I said, that solar amplifier will make that heat vision a lot more powerful as you go on. Somebody's using nature, because I heard it. Good work. I'll return you to the base. We gotta get these dispensers. Dispensers and these containers. 
That was solar flare. Basically, the way you do solar flare is you hold it and then tap it. Triangle, that is. Hive mind transmission. Navigation matrix 1226 is offline. Sit down, you stupid drone. Confirmed, HQ. The exabytes are intact. All right. There's that. Those hive stingers carry a hypnotizing neurotoxin. Lucky for There's you, one of my healing abilities. Bad news. Queen Bee's drones have LexCorp and Starlab scientists hostage inside the Metrodome. We must free those scientists before she steals their minds and converts them into drones. I gotta finish blowing up these supplies. Yeah, go for it! Yeah, getting burned always does. <clears throat> All right, I need three, uh, two more, two more barrels. Oh, really? Sit down. Here's the third one. Hive mind transmission. Drones discard on them, waiting for upgrades. Sit down. Now we do this one. Wait for that one to finish and then we'll go on. <clears throat> Take these guys out.
My squad was infiltrating the Hive's defenses when we came across LexCorp troops looting the place. They fired on us and ran. We gotta round them up before they cause more. Well, they're distracted. Yeah, try again. I got my rights. Not today, you don't. Hang on a minute. I gotta do something. Real quick. These bee guys are freaking me out. They never stop. Apparently neither do you. Okay, I'm gonna put that right there. And I'm gonna put that right there. <coughs> Dispatch, we're recovering the exobytes by any means necessary. Hey, <laughs> you're not recovering anything. You're sitting there tied up, my man. You are tied up, my dude. The science police are in Star Lab's pocket. Show them who's boss. And since I got super speed... These bee guys are freaking me out. They never stop. Neither does your mouth. Shut up. Steven. Yeah, zdit. Necessary. Sit down. Here's the... Well, if she'll get to it, there's the fourth one. Hive mind transmission. Ensure neural devices. Always function at optimal parameters. Get him out of here. Alright, now. Here's our first scientist. Excellent. I had calculated the odds. Dispatch, we're recovering the exobytes by any means necessary. <laughs> you ain't recovering nothing. And you get a <clears throat> you get a feat when for finding all these this, guys too. You're going down. You get a feat for finding all these guys too and tying them up. All the Lex Corps idiots. But it did. Here's the second one. Thank you. Uh, please make sure to tell Mr. Luther that Steven. I... Go ahead, punk. Make my day. Everybody knows you're working for Star Labs. Good. Go ahead. These bee guys are freaking me out. They never stop. <laughs> Hit him with that thing. He's like, Ugh. Swarm them. Have a seat. Steven. Thank you. The drones kept interrogating me about About time someone showed up. I have too much work and not enough. You just saved vital researchers in the fight against Brainiac. Although Lex doesn't see it, oh. we all need to be working together. But we'll save that fight for another day. For now, take out the hive's main power generator so you can get to Queen Bee. Super and find speed. out what's really behind this hive invasion. All right, let's see. Load out. I just got engulfed. 
Engulf's another good one. I'm going to put that there instead of detonate. Engulf. And I'll show you why here in just a minute. Even though engulf is a pool, and usually you use pools for your tanks to draw enemies off the off your group members. You know, you use pools to keep enemies on you, keep all the ads on you as a tank. But you can also use it offensively as well. And I'm gonna show you how I do it. So let's get to it. First, I'm gonna grab this, because this is another one. Hive mind transmission. There's the fifth Target one in this set. Sting them. them! See how I did that? Pull them to me and then hit them with, uh... Hit them with flashpoint. It's a good little combo. Burns enemies, making them vulnerable to burning effects. Flashpoint. Scorch immediate area, damaging and knocking down nearby enemies. Mass detonation. Detonate a damaging blast of flames on your target and nearby enemies. Burning enemies take additional damage and are knocked down. See, you can also combine engulf with this one, which works really well. And I think I'm going to put detonate down here on this end instead of that vortex trap. Here's where I wanted. Because there was a thing up here. And I don't know why it gives me weapons that I cannot use. I, I never understood that. Why? Put that on. Put that on. Can't use that. Yep. Star Labs pocket. Show them who's boss. I showed you who was. Everybody <laughs> knows you're working for Star Labs. Oh, do they? Yes. I got my rights. I get my rights. Not today. Go ahead and break that. By any means necessary. There's another one. Like I said, even if you don't need them, break them. Sting them! How about I sting you? These bee guys are freaking me out. They never stop. When Luther hears about this, you're going down. Swarm them. Swarm that. Intruder detected. Intruder detected. Initiating defense protocols. Alert hive soldier bees. Sting 
See? Spy Smasher. The hive mind has been breached. Overriding directive. Bring the exobytes to Brainiac. Bring the exobytes to Brainiac. Bring the exobytes to Brainiac! Guards! Protect your queen with your lives! Destroy the intruder! One with my hive mind. Ah, more drones for the hive. Who is this I Shall will you? serve the queen. You are one mind. I am many. your independence you will serve me and brainiac in the end initiating combat shield now active signaling brainiac for assistance self-preservation from now we know Brainiac is in control of Queen Bee. He's using her drones to recover his exobytes. I hope this stings Brainiac in the end. But if she doesn't, we will. I'll be in touch. And thanks. Superman out. Alright, there's the exit. But before we go out, here's the last part of that collection. Hive mind transmission. The Queen commands the queen commands us So now you're the hero-sized bug zapper. Nice! I'll be working with you again soon. I, the Monitor, am gathering the multiverse to face its greatest threat yet. We will need every ally we can get, even unexpected ones. Meet me aboard the House of Legends. All right, let's see. And these are my allies, if it'll go to the right thing. Those are the allies that I have. And depending on what I want to do, they do different things. Like, this character, I already have a fire tank, so this one's going to be a fire DPS, which means Batman, right there in the top left corner, who's highlighted right now, will go in the middle, and we'll use From the Shadows, because From the Shadows will make your character stronger. <clears throat> the higher up you rank him, the stronger your character will be. He increases your uh, might by a great percentage. Okay, and then Adam, Black Adam, will either that or Zatanna, depending on whether or not I decide to use Robot Sidekick, if I use Robot Sidekick. Zatanna, with her... Uh, 
like right there where it says arcane battery basically uh, Zatanna if you have robot sidekick or any other ability summoned pet she will increase their damage that they do she increases their uh, damage by a percentage so I might throw her in there too if I use robot sidekick okay or I could use Shazam power of Shazam Lee activating an allies combat ability grants 3% might and 1.5% precision for 30 seconds but that goes up the higher you rank him the higher you the higher you build him the more that goes up same thing for all these guys but anyway let's get rolling take that out don't need that open this up and we are currently what are we level 14 so We're going to go here Heads first. Up, there's trouble in the Tomorrow District. Circe's bestia morphs are all over the area, which means Circe can't we be do, far behind. Satana in the Chinatown safe house can give you further instructions. Let's go to Midtown because I'm at level 14 now and I can go get level 14 gear. But I've got to go to Midtown to get it. I can't get it where I was in Little Bohemia that vendor is not high enough to do it come right here to this I'm guy stuff you need to beat back See? the bad guys buddy you just buy one of each of these buy that put all this in See, I just got another 25 point feet for that. I'm selling the stuff you need to beat back the bad guys, buddy. Sell all that. Super speed. Alright, I gotta put one more in that and then I can start working on my uh, other stuff. And I have new mail. Let's go see what the mail is. Probably from Flash. Nope, Martian Manhunter. Um, now that we've got that. Before we go to Chinatown, though, let's go to... Well, I'm going to have to warp. Warp, House of Legends, Watchtower. Okay. You want to come to this the metal wing. The watchtower. We've retrofitted it a bit for all you new heroes. Click on we that. To John Stewart, Stewart, Superman, to the plan. And the metal wing architect. was designed for Just you. Follow your mini map. Spending a lot of time consoles. here with other meta I'll heroes tell you about like the place. Flash and Power Girl. Check out the vendor's console for specialized meta human strength equipment. With your superpowers, you'll need gear that can take as much punishment as you do. Alright, before we go downstairs to this other spot... Come back here behind where Power Girl is, and grab this. It's Oracle. That hollow token shows the emblem of the Meta uh, Wing. Superman classic. Meta humans gain their powers from their unique genetic heritage. These heroes are mentored by Superman.
Justice League Watchtower was specially designed to help heroes meet and get the equipment they need. But it's an unwritten JLA rule that you must gain renown with fact exclusive gear. Our goal is to create solidarity with the entire hero cause. Each wing in the watchtower has There's its own the bank. Wayne Enterprises, just like the Queen one in my base, others all contribute see? to a fund all my that rewards right heroic here. activity and provides this secure storage for your gear. And there's the broker. And there's the mailbox. And each wing has those. There's Mickey Cannon. We'll use we'll talk to him shortly. Here's some of the other vendors that you can get different types of gear from. That's PvP gear though. I don't fool with that. Here's the second token. Oracle here. That hollow token shows the emblem of the magic wing. Magic users connect to the mystical forces of the universe. These heroes are mentored by Wonder Woman and work with the Sentinels of Magic. Right here's where you want to go. Welcome to the Watchtower's central hub. You can get to just about anywhere in the Watchtower from here. All three wings, the mailboxes, the monitor womb, and the war room. The Watchtower itself is visible from Earth and maintains multiple security measures. Each wing in the Watchtower has its own bank. Wayne Enterprises, Queen Industries, and others all contribute to a fund that rewards heroic activity and provides this secure storage for your gear. Uh, Lady Shiva. Each piece of enhanced battle armor is available in multiple combat roles and customized colors. That's for the uh, Doomed Metropolis uh, DLC, Death of Superman, that they Welcome did years the ago. Like, I this think it was like Martian Manhunter determines our that was like six, six or seven world. years ago. The Huntress that they is also did that. Hand that was a long time ago. Investigations from the question. Across the way is the Hall of Heroes, where Batman, Superman, and Wonder Woman coordinate the League. Only official Justice League members can enter the Hall. Only official Justice League members can enter the Hall. Alright, there's that. Now, Huntress. If you really want to fight crime, you'll need to do some detective work. Clues open up investigations, collections, and briefings to aid the good fight. Oracle's even rigged your interface to show colored markers when valuable information is near. Find one here Here's in the, the third one. then come back to me. Oracle here. That hollow token represents the hub, the core of the watchtower, the seat of heroic... Yep, that'd be a clue. See how many you can bring in, and I'll let the question know you're on the case. She's not much of one for crowds, so just check your email. Happy hunting. I like that new Huntress style they put out a couple years back. I also like classic Huntress as well. Alright. Got that. Welcome to the Watchtower. This is the Watchtower War Room, our state-of-the-art training area. Talk to Beast Boy for access to the simulator where you can practice other hero and And down there are some Ambush of your style vendors, like different outfits and capes and masks and different things you can get. Like, I'll show you real quick what I'm talking about. Here's the one where you can get different types of, uh, like your chest piece and your leg piece, you know, like top and bottoms, your tops and bottoms. These are like your different shirts. And then you go down into the pants, you can get like different types of skirts, 
you know, for girls. Now over here, these are like head these are like your uh, head pieces, masks, head pieces. These are emblems, victory tokens, exabytes. Take that. And these are your different types of gloves boots and capes Leave different back alone. pieces so those are just a few of your style items so like I said collecting styles come get them there's style vendors all over this place and in the house of legends but right now let's go back to the metal wing because we've got to go to the reactor core We're now at the Watchtower Reactor Core. Star Labs and Firestorm rigged it to power the entire Watchtower. If you're looking to immediately take out some villains, you'll find Hawkman and Cyborg here with the latest intel. With the latest intel? Oh, wait, wait. Almost forgot. This Always thing. nice to pass through the aquacultural area. A little green spot in the midst of this gigantic satellite. And that thing right there. This is where we keep Star Labs that recalibrating thing, oh, yeah, attributes that, devices. That does the same thing as your respect station your in your base. Your edge. Where I said Take you can reset your skill points. That's what that does. I mean, you don't lose any of your skill points when you do it. It just allows you to reset them where you can refine your, uh, like your super speed, your iconic powers, you know, whatever. You can, you can reset your stat tree, in other words. And there's the it's last Oracle. of that one. That hollow token shows the emblem of the tech wing. Tech users use advanced technology and gadgets as their primary tools. These heroes are mentored by Batman. The Watchtower hangar holds some small portion of the Watchtower fleet. The Flash is usually here with information on various races rigged all over the world. And there are different vendors down here as well. Like, here's some right here. Here's some different style vendors. Here's another one over there. All four of these. Come check them out. Now we gotta go back to the metal wing. So there you have it, the Justice League Watchtower. You're now part of a mighty heroic tradition. Welcome, and make us proud. I'm sure we'll be talking again soon. Oracle out. All right. You're doing a There's great that job done. out there. The Lords of Order, Project Next, Cadmus, we can and start Magnus working on my stat have points. stepped up to offer a hand. Why don't you go chat with Mickey Cannon in the Meadow Wing? He's the director of Project Cadmus and can give you the lowdown on how to get an edge with research. Hey, kid. Cannon's the name. 
Mickey Cannon. I'm the director of Project Cadmus, and I'm here to help all you meta folks get the hang of research and development. A little know-how about your gear and yourself can help turn the battle in your favor. Once you get yourself some plans and some components, you can use this R&D station to fix up lots of things. Here, take these items. They'll help you get going. You're doing a great job out there. The Lords of Order, Project Cadmus, and Magnus Robotics have stepped up to offer don't a hand. Don't need those. Why don't you go chat with Mickey there Cannon in the Meadow Wing? He's the director of Project Cadmus and can give you the lowdown on how to get an edge with research and development. Heads up, there's trouble in the Tomorrow District. Circe's beastia morphs are all over the area, which, which where means we're Circe headed. can't be far behind. Satana in the Chinatown safe house can give you further instructions. You're doing a great job out there. The Lord's... Now we go see Zatanna. You're doing a great job out there. The Lords of Order, Project Cadmus, and Magnus That gets Robotics so annoying after a little bit. A hand. Why don't you go chat with Mickey Cannon in the Meadow Wing? He's the director of Project Cadmus and can give you the lowdown on how to get an edge with research and development. Amazon forces, including Wonder Girl herself, have responded, but more showtime. The demon Trigon is rising right here. I call upon you as one who has been proven in battle. Dr. Fate's ward against Trigon has broken. Now Trigon's demons rampage throughout the Tomorrow District. The science police's powers are not enough. Defend against this evil and hurry. And hurry. All right, let's do Bestia Morph Havoc first. Then we'll deal with Raven's crap. Check my time. Almost about that time again. Uh, boss lady. <laughs> Cute name, though. Cute character. Okay. My greetings. Circe's bestiomorphs are running rampant in the Tomorrow District. Wonder Girl went in to investigate, but I have not heard from her since. Clearly, Circe is up to foul play. I charge you, track down. The carving on this horn is likely something. My greetings. Circe's bestiomorphs are running rampant in the Tomorrow District. Wonder Girl went in to investigate, but I have not heard from her since. Clearly, Circe is up to foul play. I charge you, track down and defeat Circe's plans. Yeah, go for it. Hit him with the pool, hit him with backdraft, or I mean uh, flashpoint, and then hit him with mass detonation before they can get up. Automatic finisher for these, well, for like lesser enemies. Go. Oh boy. Oh really? Giganta kidnapped Wonder Girl? She's always wanted the power of an Amazon princess. 
They like that heat vision. Seriously, must have promised her exactly that. We have to get to Wonder Girl quickly. Circe's beasts will know where Giganta has taken Wonder Girl. Seek out Lieutenant Pythia. She will give you something to loosen their tongues. She will give you something to loosen their tongues. Oh, really? Cersei's bestia morphs carry Cersei's ambrosia elixir. Oh good, you were here. Take this torch of remembrance. Wonder Woman wants its power in your- That Promethean flame will draw the information out of those bestia morphs. No matter how the poor beasts try to protect their mistress. Cersei promised Wonder Girl to Giganta. It is not uncommon for them to engrave symbols of their conquests onto tusks and fangs. Enough! They took Amazon Girl to the Metro. Take this torch of remembrance. Please! We've got the help! The ritual has begun! You too late. Huh. <laughs> Tell you nothing. Oh, yeah, you will. Help. Let my power recharge a little bit. Kidnapping those mystic stones. All this points to Circe creating a ritual to swap Giganta's mind into Wonder Girl's body. This is really big. Um, no pun intended. Circe has enchanted those Sisyphean stones to prevent you from passing through. Destroy them! We must stop the ritual Circe and Giganta have planned for Wonder Girl. Alright guys, I'm going to have to cut it right here and we'll pick this up in just a second. So, look for the next one. <laughs>